a good Lemmy story. Um, I've told the stories before how many times Lemmy and Motorhead bailed me out, whether it's playing the final night of the Cat House or the Cat House 20th anniversary or when I did a Cat House resurgence. Motorhead always stepped up and Lemmy always played. And uh, one of the few bands that he and his manager would always send me birthday greetings every single birthday. But as far as the Lemmy story that stands out, um, back when I lived in Los Angeles, it was uh, ri my flies undone. <laughs> It was really, really hot in the summer, about 1994 in Hollywood, and I had a huge barbecue. I mean, the guys from Slayer were there, Suicidal Tendencies, Rob Zombie, Gilby, even Mark McGrath from Sugar Ray was there, um, Rob Halford, it was, it was cool. So anyways, barbecue's going on, and uh, Lemmy walks in, he's got his jean jacket on, no shirt, cowboy boots, and denim shorts that were about the width of a belt. I mean, they were half of the size of a pair of Daisy Dukes. They were like this high. And he walked in here with these really, really tight denim shorts on, but it was Lemmy, so like nobody said, look what Lemmy's, no, I think people did say look at what Lemmy's wearing, but nobody commented because it's Lemmy, and uh, he almost made it look cool, even with the black cowboy boots. But I had this uh, room where I had like all these um, ancient Indian artifacts, and on the wall there was, uh, a couple tomahawks and one of them was a tomahawk slash peace pipe that I actually didn't know. Lemmy was like a historian, I guess he knew it. But somebody went up and they said, yeah, Lemmy's in the uh, living room and he's trying to smoke weed out of one of your uh, Indian artifacts. And I just thought that made it so much cooler. <laughs> so that was kind of a funny memory of uh, Lemmy smoking weed out of my Indian tomahawk, wearing really tight, tight denim shorts Oh, and everybody was getting pulled in the, pushed in the pool, and Lemmy said, uh, hey, make sure I don't get pushed in the pool. That was a bad Lemmy imitation, by the way. Make sure I don't get pushed in the pool because I got me in my front pocket. And uh, I'm not going to tell you exactly what it was, but it wasn't tea. But uh, today a lot of people are remembering some great things about Lemmy, and a lot of people are, are saying it with a smile because Lemmy has been getting so much press lately. I mean, Ace of Spades is number one. And a lot of people are acknowledging what us rockers have known all along. Motorhead's the best. Lemmy's God. And we love you, Lemmy.